Welcome back to my little channel. Yeah, yeah, the forest is out and all that. This one isn't a funny one. This isn't me debunking the nonsense of climate change. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll have one in the pipeline trying to explain why the whole CO2 hoax is such a violent one. But this is even worse. Now, everyone is talking about the bushfires in Australia, which are pretty bad they're not the worst i mean they've seen worse but yeah the, the fact that people seen worse is no comfort to the people who lost their homes or indeed family members so i'll not play light i don't want to because it is pretty bad and obviously the the woke idiots keep claiming that this is climate change but at this point in time, the police in Australia are basically saying, yeah, no, at least 50% of this has been lit by people. So not all of it, but at least 50%. And those numbers may rise. Now they, they, they arrested nearly 200 people. And, and tensions are flaring up. Now, obviously, no one is surprised about that. So then we see stuff like this. String him up. Accused firebug is hit with death threats and confronted by furious locals at court as he's charged with lighting a bushfire. After three people died in blazes nearby. So he didn't start the one that killed those three people. No, no, those people were already dead. And then still he has the audacity to start the bushfire. Now, I'm not going to give too much attention to this. I'm not going to. I mean, you can see his name. It's still there, but I'm going to take it away because I don't want to give the guy any notoriety uh, uh, fair enough my channel is small enough so who cares but seriously nearly 200 people have been arrested for setting fire to brushes and well for the people i'm not showing the photo but you can see it's a typical australian man with with light brown skin and all that and and he has a very australian name it's it's not at all asian sounding and in this case asian uh the chinese version yeah none of those things it makes you wonder why these people put the, the world on fire so to speak but some people simply do like to watch the world burn maybe i should have used the background of people liking to watch the world burn Maybe I still will. But there's something seriously wrong. And the politicians keep pushing the global warming ones. And the activists keep pushing the global warming one. And oh no, look at the world burning. I mean, there are several reasons why this is happening. And and the not clearing of the brush is one of them. The not backburning is, is a second one of them. Now, there are environmental reasons as well. For example... I'll show an image here showing you that the area in the water was rather cold at one side of Australia. And funny enough, because it's cold, water doesn't evaporate as much, which means there is less downpour. So let, let that sink in. The water was cool. It wasn't too warm. It was too fucking cool global warming idiots had it been warmer then there would have been more evaporation in the ocean and there would have been more downpour not a lot more it's still australia mind you but still more so if anything having a little bit warmer temperature would have probably prevented this whole bullshit. Well, no, it wouldn't, because then there would still be idiots putting the place on fire. 
hadn't we had an idiot putting a lighter to the underbrush and setting it on fire, it might have been less bad. Now, the, the article I'm linking to downstairs, yeah, he's one of the nearly 200 people. And people will tell you, well, yeah, but they've only been indicted. Trust you me. In situations like this, I doubt they're going to indict you lightly because no one wants to believe it's done by humans putting the stuff up on fire. Hell, this guy did it three uh, days after three people died. So he knew what would happen when he would do something like this. Yeah, that's all right. He still did it. Well, obviously he did it. He doesn't have a fixed address. He didn't have anywhere to go. Now he has a nice cell to go to. Personally, I would say Australia. Kick him back to wherever he came from. And I know that sounds anti-foreigner. But my problem is not with Johnny Foreigner. I don't care about Johnny Foreigner. My problem is with people creating situations where other people can die in. Well, and with the ecological mafia that tries to blame everything on some fairy called global warming. But, yeah. Okay, this is my rant over. Um... I am trying to grow my channel. This probably isn't one of the best videos for that. But like, share and subscribe. And I hope to see you all next time. And um, whatever you do, educate yourself, people. Don't believe the global warming hype. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying temperatures aren't changing. It's not man-made. Oh, I, I really have to do that video. Anyway, see you all next time.